I've got a lot more saltpeter on the mine now, so hopefully I'll be able to catch back up. Um, I might have to add more flax fields as well, cause I don't, but I don't know. I'm never sure about this linen pouch situation. I do have 700 unemployed colonists. Because, because, because obviously the gunpowder pouches get created and then used up. Need a lot more linen, dude. But, but I, I think the gunpowder pouches get they t get turned back into linen pouches. But I don't know if, if some of them get used up. You see. Oh, they do. Look, You're right. They do get turned now, back into linen pouches. Five hundred twenty-eight. So this should go up to like about 600 by the end of the night. Um, so let's check, let's watch it. Because I want to know if it's actually using them up. So that some of them are being destroyed by the gunpowders. Because they're like careless, they're not, they're not recycling their, mm. their matchlock pouches. They're just, I don't know, using them to store coins or they're, they're chucking them in the sea. Yeah, see, they do chuck some of them in the sea. There's not quite enough. <laughs> These lazy gunners are not recycling their pouches efficiently. Okay, that means I'm going to need a little bit more flax. Wait, they're chucking pouches in the sea? What? You should yeah. definitely have more than one flax field. Oh, yeah, That's I've got six here now. Okay. Um, but I'm going to add ten more, I think. That's a lot more. Well, then another couple of ten by tens, yeah. Not, not ten more fields, but All right. <laughs> maybe another six fields. And then that'll keep me, keep me in the linen. And then I can... If I've got, if I have, find myself with really excess linen, I can just carpet everywhere. True. Just put carpets down for my peeps. I feel like um, that's the thing that that maybe you could like, maybe would be good to be added to the game. Like stuff like, just just unnecessary stuff like, how about you just carpet everywhere now? You know, like everyone just kind of. If people is... moved like faster on carpet or like something like that, you know, give it a reason. On your main like pathways, have uh, have carpet there. People move. 20% faster walking around. So there is like a reason to do it. Is there? Is that, is that well, actually, no, no. If, oh, that, no. if that was a thing, right. that'd oh. be great. I'd love that. That would be that would be ideal. Can we add that? Um, Devs, thanks. Man, it's nice that they just add everything we, we ask for, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. What a, what a cool bunch <laughs> of guys. We've asked for so much this time. They're going to be like, oh, God. <laughs> it's God, so, it's we take notes. <laughs> There's uh, so much they want. Many. Why are they doing this to They've us? They've suddenly gone overboard. <laughs> this is way too much. All right, flax farmers. Okay, this is an entirely new field of flax. Uh, how are your defenses? Because I did add like seven hundred more guys. Or no, not. Oh God. No, like like five hundred more guys. We were nearly overrun the other day. Well, I'm out of um, I'm out of gunpowder ammo completely. Okay, that's really bad. I need to go and check actually. Just just how bad. Check there's not a, a horrible breach. But I, I I usually time it so the zombies. The the, the nice thing about the um, the the, the route that we've made is that it's t just long enough that they don't um, that they that they are, sorry it's just long enough that they don't get distracted and count as siege mode because I think if you do it too long your I maze think you do I think if it's if it's like two thousand long I heard it goes into siege mode so they don't use it properly oh um, but what we've got here is just long enough I think that's but, because like the they only pathed up to two thousand blocks ahead of them. But the main wave of zombies also arrives during the day, um, which is nice because then I'm busy producing new oh. gunpowder. I like, how, I like how when it's daytime, the mine gets lighter. Oh. Right. <laughs> yeah, well, the, the, the sun rays can penetrate through layers of, of thin rock, porous rock. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Like, it's all like, it's all like, uh, what's, the, what's that really like holy rock? Pumice. 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 <laughs> is that like a holy rock? <laughs> what? Pumice. Yeah. That's why you use it for like rubbing your feet. What? Oh, I thought I thought you meant holy, as in like religious. No, I mean like full of oh, holes. Oh, like porous. <laughs> <laughs> Not <laughs> okay. That makes that right. makes much more sense. It's like what? Po is that famous for being being very religious? Yeah. Okay, we're out of ammo again. Uh oh. It happens quite quick, you know. I still have. Quite no, a lot. I, I run out of as well. Go. I need more linen because I haven't got enough linen bags to shoot all these. Have you guys got bags. enough guns, like on your? I've got a fuckload of guns, but I ran out of gunpowder, as you do. It feels like the only things that are spawning really are these red boys, anyway. Now, have you guys noticed? Yeah. Yeah. And the other things hit them, but you need to hit him like several times. Yeah. So you can get away with like just a shitload of crossbows, but you need like shit even like, twice as many. Maybe I should get more crossbows. Just because... If you've got a lot of unemployed guys, you might as well just take them on crossbow duty. Well, that's true. Because I've got... I mean, I've got, like, 1,200 crossbow bolts just sitting around. Actually, that's a really good idea, Duffy. Daytime crossbow guards. Let's add some of these to the mix. 
just to, just to keep just to give people jobs. It's kind of like you know we're just finding jobs for unemployed. So I, I, I got the opposite right problem. Uh, I don't have enough dudes. To oh, do all my jobs. I've got like uh, let's see, I've still got a hundred unemployed guys. So when they finish digging, do they instantly go unemployed again? Yeah, they it's do. It's like doing army service. Like as soon as they join Colony Island, they get drafted into like the the, the daytime crossbow guard. It's kind of a cushy <laughs> job. <laughs> oh yeah, daytime crossbow guard is like a real nice one. <laughs> Uh, okay, five, ten, ten daytime crossbow guards don't even have crossbows, which is great for them. Wow, oh man, you just get to sit in the barracks, <laughs> fucking eat berries and bread, and uh... Just wait for your crossbow to be built. Yeah. No, no, that's actually, people actually the it's, forge. it's way less cushy than that. It's basically standing in line watching the horde of zombies approach and know that you've got no weapon. <laughs> oh, but you have to shit. stand in line with the other daytime crossbow guards, some of which whom have weapons. But you know that when they go down, you're going to have to yeah. pick up that weapon as... And you're going to get, like, one shot off before you get eaten. You can maybe, like, take it in turns. You're like, oh, it's surely it's my turn for the crossbow I want to use the crossbow. It's got to be my turn, right? <laughs> I, just, I found a layer with absolutely no ore. There's, like, the no ore layer. Have you found that one? Is it, like, super deep? No. A layer of no ore? Absolutely nothing. What are you talking about? No That's, ore. like, most of the land. Oh, I see what you mean. Like a layer underground where there's no ore. What are you... At all. No ore? What, what do you mean loads of the area underground has no ore? What? <laughs> <laughs> loads of under... Loads... Half... Most of underground doesn't have ore in it. Really? <laughs> what do you mean a horizontal layer? Or a vertical layer? Hor what are you talking horizontal about? Horizontal layer? With not a single ore. There's loads of that. Is there? Yeah, it's like it comes... So it's like the layer... Look in Tom's massive hole. Ah, uh, I don't want to. Look in the massive hole. Tom, can you look in your massive hole for a second? I'm I'm underground currently digging. Well, in any case, yeah, it's like you should know this, Duncan. I, well, I didn't know that. God's sake, Duncan. Every time I dug out, I've just found like shit tons of ore. Well, that's not how it works. No, it's like it's in it's the ore is in layers. It's not. Right. That's why when you build your mine, it's like a big flat layer. Because all the ore spawns between, like... Yeah, yeah, like 15 blocks down and 20 blocks down or something. Okay, yeah. Um, and then there'll be, like, five blo like five layers of, like, just stone. And then the next ones. Right. I did hear that they added, like, functionality to this that let you do, like, multiple builds. What? Um, like, I think you can add, like... For example, if you wanted to build a house with builders, I think you can, like... Oh, that that's cool. Do that. Yeah. Not sure that's true, but I don't know how it'll work either for for big builds like this. This is a complex build. This pyramid, you know, it ain't gonna, it ain't it ain't straightforward. This is it's high high tier building. Let's give everyone who's unemployed a job building it. Okay, everyone's everyone's got a job now. Really? Yeah. Holy shit. Unemployed zero. Mm. Fifteen hundred colonists employed. I think maybe we should get the first 2,000 dudes employed. <laughs> <laughs> Tom will still beat you. Oh, yeah, that's true. I'll be like, well, um, looks like I'm putting down 100 millstones. <laughs> um, <laughs> I think I might have that already. <laughs> right. so, how about first to be called Lewis playing the game? Oh, there you go. A, per a good challenge. Oh, congrats, man. You won. Yay. What I'm a, the best at colony survival. What a guy. I survived the best, guys. Yeah. You did it so well. Yeah. 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 I did it. I'm the hero. Let's, shall I pump it up? Or shall I pump it up? To pump like, it up. I'll pump it up to like some more cop some more zombs. The next tier. Are you serious? We, you just said you couldn't afford to kill them all. Yeah, but I sort of I am sort of paying attention. I think with the crossbows added, it will be fine. Mm -hmm. Actually, famous last words. Mm. If you die, I die as well. We all die. Oh, well, Tom's got you got. They got to go through you and then me and then they get to Tom. Yeah. We all die together. Also, do you know what? It's not that bad. Like another five hundred on top of what we already have. How bad is that? I'm adding more as well. I'm nearly at a thousand. I did put a whole load more gunners down last night. I, I need to get some more gunpowder production going after I've done this. Did anyone ever do the the, 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 the like analysis of wheat field sizes and stuff? Like, is there any best size? 5 by 10. I mean, uh, I always do the I, 10 by 10. I, I do uh, 
four by twenty five. Oh, right. I mean, no, it's five by twenty. I think that's what I do. I mean, I I do that sometimes, but part of me wants to believe. I want to believe that the that doing them slightly smaller is more efficient because when they're ready to harvest, they get harvested and replanted quicker. You know, so uh, part of me wants to believe that smaller fields are actually just one by one a percentage. Yeah, like a one. Of, <laughs> just have like ten thousand guys. Just Fuck you! I guess you could like if you have like five hundred dudes unemployed, <laughs> just fucking let each person have a one meter square little like farm allotment. they have to look after. I'm just saying, just, just a pot throwing it out. Single there. corn seed in it. <laughs> they just have to make sure. Well, again, like, but this is where we're leaning towards. Like, you know, with more people a civilization working together it's more efficient you know if pe- people have to do less work overall it's like all to, you know with the industrial revolution you didn't need loads of people coming out on the farms anymore you just need one guy with a tractor you know so we, we're the same we're moving forward in technology and eventually it'll be like star trek you know and everyone will just be able to live and there'll be no money and then it'll just be robots doing everything like robot uber drivers and robots taking hello this is your package or it'll be like judge dread which is exactly the same but much more horrible yeah where where like 98 percent of jobs are done by done by robots and uh then everyone else just goes out and commits crimes yeah because there's nothing else to do and they're really bored yeah but that said they'll be playing fortnite and league of legends do you know what i mean it's fine i'm watching twitch streams that's what i do god that's what i did all weekend was just like hanging out Hello, this Watching. is RoboGamer69. I am playing Fortnite 19. Yeah, robots will take over that as well because they'll be way better at it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. And they'll be funnier than us. <laughs> but like, you're trying to play Fortnite, but like, just these fucking robots everywhere, just literally just aimbotting, but they don't need to, like, actually aimbot. I don't know. I don't know if computers are ever going to be... Robots are ever going to be better than uh, better than human players. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's <that's> AlphaGo. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I suppose you've got you've got a point, a, a valid point. I will concede it to you. Aren't they making like robot Dota teams now? That, like, oh, there was that, ass. that thing of like p- players like programming mm. people because they did the um, who who's the big the big Dota guy? He played against an AI, um, like m- mid, and it kicked his ass. He got um, defeated, it. but. Um, in turn, like there was a limit on like characters that could be used, and like certain items that were like banned as well. Oh right, because um, hadn't been coded in. Well, it's like basically like some weapons or like upgrades create such like abstract scenarios that it's like impossible to or very very hard to uh, program for. But isn't that like the element of a game though to like kind of be tricksy and un- unpredictable and like I don't know. I watched a thing about AlphaGo. I thought it was really interesting. Cuz you you were you, you Duncan you actually bought a Go set. Yeah, I like Go. After game. after you heard that a robot had become better at everyone else at Go, you decided to learn Go. Now like, it's my time. Like, oh, do you know what? <laughs> I don't think these Go players are very good. If a robot could beat him, I think I could get into it. And you, yeah. I played it quite a lot actually online. Have you? What's your go rating? Oh, it's it's pretty bad. I'm like the one above noob. <laughs> <laughs> noob plus. Yeah. Uh, th- the game is definitely slowing down. Yeah. Have you noticed this? Everyone takes like one step at a time. This happens sometimes in the mornings. Yeah, when everyone oh, comes it, back out to work. It looks really bad though. Like, look at the zombies. <laughs> <laughs> it's happened before. There's a lot of zombies coming. Oh, they're firing. not even animating now. They're just. Oh, I should prefer the game like this. Everyone just like just teleporting one square, like turn based. Yeah, it looks like I'm playing fucking like Dwarf Fortress or something. <laughs> okay, well we got it under control. The additional crossbow tiers legion have 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 joined the the ranks of Colony Island to see off these horrible zombs. I got over a thousand dudes now. Wow! wow. Is that your man. first time at a thousand dudes. Probably. How is Tiki Town supporting that many? I thought it was like some sort of agrarian society, ballooned out of its initial like well, small. Because I, I, I got the uh, ultimate upgrade on the, the the size, I can pretty much build like really far. Yeah. Okay. It's fine. So what if you have you? It's, it's through your through great research. Pre- yeah, we're a scientific utopia. I see. Oh, really? We're like Wakanda. 
Okay. Oh my god, you are. You are like Wakanda. Um, the, 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 I haven't seen Black Panther, but I know I've heard enough about it, and also I saw the new Infinity War. Yeah, you saw War, it so. in Infinity War. Yeah, I'm kind of aware of what it is. Yeah.